Welcome to the setup guide for recording interoperative assessments. Here we will describe the configuration and use of head-mounted GoPro cameras for use in the OR. Residents are reminded to review the policies and procedures for recording videos in the OR before recording any cases. The accompanying document is available on SharePoint. From the main page, select Documents, then Residency Program, then Operative Assessments, and then open the document titled Video Recording, or use the QR code present in the case with a GoPro camera. To record a surgical case using the GoPro, follow these preparatory steps. First, ensure that the attending surgeon has agreed to record the case. Then ensure that you have sufficient time to prepare the camera and troubleshoot any problems before the start of the case. Locate the GoPro storage case and ensure that the following items are present. A laminated card providing links to this video, as well as to the accompanying document on SharePoint and the GoPro mobile app, is included in the case. USB cable, which will be used to charge the GoPro. Thumb screw to attach the camera to the head strap. The head strap and mounting plate. Ensure there is a good fit with no slippage over your preferred head covering. Ensure that the strap is clean and the plate is undamaged. If you encounter a damaged or soiled head strap, alert Johanna Hinman via email and the strap will be replaced. A USB card reader for use in transferring videos. The GoPro camera, either a Hero 8 or Hero 9. Ensure that the battery is installed and fully charged. Ensure the memory card is installed and cleared of previous recordings. Instructions to charge the unit, confirm memory card placement, and clear recordings are provided later in this video. You will also need a smartphone with the GoPro app installed. There is a QR code on the laminated card that will help you to install the Quick app. To install the app, open your camera or QR code reading app on your phone and then aim the phone's camera at the QR code labeled Install GoPro Quick App. When prompted, open the link to your phone's associated app store. Install the app following the instructions provided. Now mount the GoPro onto the head strap. Remove the GoPro camera from the case. Extend the mounting legs by rotating them from the recessed areas at the bottom of the camera housing. Orient the camera with the lens pointing out and fit the legs into the corresponding slots on the mounting plate. Insert the thumb screw and tighten the mount so that the camera is snug but can be repositioned. You will now link the GoPro camera to the app on your smartphone. This will enable you to view the live GoPro video using the screen on your phone. This will be necessary to ensure that the camera is properly aimed to capture the operative field. If you have already linked to the GoPro camera, you can skip this step. Be aware that the unique cameras assigned to each campus will have to be linked separately on your phone. Power on the GoPro camera using the power button on the side of the unit. Launch the Quick app on your smartphone. Tap the camera icon on the upper right of your screen. Tap the Add Camera icon also on the upper right. Tap the type of camera to be used, Hero 8 or Hero 9. This type is specified above the power button on the side of the camera. Tap the button to indicate that the camera is on. Follow the on-screen instructions on your phone to use the touch screen on the GoPro camera to complete the linking process. If prompted to rename the camera, keep the existing name. Now place the camera and head strap on your head outside the OR and before scrubbing. Now activate the preview video. The list of paired cameras will indicate that the GoPro has been found. Tap the camera picture and the app will connect. Tap the Enable Preview button. If prompted to join the camera's Wi-Fi network, tap Join. Your phone's screen will now display the camera's video with a slight delay. Use the screen of your smartphone to adjust the camera angle, similar to how you would aim a headlight. Now turn off Preview, quit the app, or just lock your phone. You are now ready to record the desired portion of the operation. Scrub, gown, and glove as usual. When ready to record, either have the OR staff press the record button on the top of the camera or use a sterile towel to press the button yourself without contaminating your gloves. Ensure that the camera aim is not dislodged when recording is started. For shorter cases, it may be possible to start recording prior to scrubbing. You should do so only if it is possible to scrub after the patient drapes are applied. Once your video is complete, 
pressing the record button again will stop further recording. The camera and head strap can then be removed if desired. Begin by opening the camera's side door. The door is located next to the record button and opposite the power button. Pull the latch toward the bottom of the camera and rotate the door to the side. This will expose the battery, storage card, and USB port. Note that a USB Type-C cable is necessary to charge the camera. Such a cable is included in the case. Do not attempt to insert a micro USB cable, as shown here, as this will damage the camera. When recording is complete, replace the items in the camera carrying case as shown here.